Morning, morning, morning. Five minute meditators. I hope that you had a restful weekend and that you're waking up this morning filled with gratitude, grace, and thanksgiving. I hope that as you're going through this month of making commitments and honoring yourself in those commitments, that you are preparing yourself for challenges because challenges do come up. There's nothing that anyone can promise you about having a smooth life, never have anything going on or things of that nature because it just doesn't happen. Challenges come so that one, it could test our belief system to help us identify areas of improvement and three, so that we can actually begin to trust our innate self. That's why challenges come. They don't always feel comfortable but they come. So ready? One, two, three. Deep breath in. And hold. Hold. Hold that breath. Just a few more seconds holding that breath in. And release. Today I recognize that challenges are coming. Today, I recognize that challenges are coming. Not that you're inviting them in, not that you're, you know, wanting them to um, be a part of who you are, but we know that they're coming. There are going to be challenges that, you know, try to sneak us, you know, that sneak attack. Well, the truth is, is they're coming. We're on guard and prepared. Tests come to see what our testimony can be. Don't give up in this commitment process because you're challenged. Ready? One, two, three. Deep breath in. And hold. Hold. Hold that breath. Just a few more seconds holding that breath in. And release. I accept challenges and I identify myself. I accept challenges and I identify myself. When a challenge comes, instead of spending energy in the negative space saying, forget my life and my life is messed up and all that kind of stuff, accept the challenge and accept and assess where is it coming from? What's my lesson? What is it that I need to understand? What do I need to change? Why am I being challenged in this area? Is this a repeated challenge, right? Because if it's a repeated challenge, that means there's a lesson that hasn't been learned that you need to learn in order to move forward. Ready? One, two, three. Deep breath in. And hold. Hold. Hold that breath. Just a few more seconds holding that breath in. And release. I honor myself through the challenge. I honor myself through the challenge. Listen, challenges, again, they're going to come. Honoring yourself. Don't cave in. Don't quit. Don't start speaking negative things while you're going through a challenge. Stop. Like I, like I, I try to think about it. Stop, drop, and roll. You know, stop. Stopping means identifying what's going on. Drop. Find your assessment places, identify areas of improvement, and roll. Roll through the challenge with the punches that they bring and put yourself in a position that you don't have to go through that challenge again. Ready? One, two, three. Deep breath in. And hold. Hold. Hold that breath. Just a few more seconds holding that breath in. And release. I appreciate my challenges and show myself grace. I appreciate my challenges and show myself some grace. You have to show yourself grace. Listen, I don't care what we're doing in life. You're pretty much creating the manual for you on the go. Just because somebody else may have gone through a particular thing or situation one way doesn't mean that that's your way. Your manual is being written every step that you take and every breath that you make. It's being written. So show yourself some grace. 
Go through these challenges. Learn the lessons. Love on you. Watch your mouth. Watch your mind. And watch your heart. But I see you. Namaste.